Some longtime tobacco farmers are looking towards new crops in the mid-state. Hemp is the most talked about newcomer. And as News Channel 5's Kyle Horan learned, some are using it as a safety net in case the need for tobacco dries up. He says farming like this runs back in his family four generations. Lee Bagwell says his father, grandfather, great-grandfather, they all grew tobacco just like this. However, he's adding in a new crop so that future generations will have something to fall back on. Getting the stigma surrounding hemp, you know, off of it, I really think will be the biggest deal. The amount of detail it takes. Really the main goal with, you know, controlling weeds is being able to get this stuff up. Uh, controlling the weeds before it gets bushy. Really? Uh, just looking uh, pests. Is almost staggering. When we scout, we're also looking for uh, beneficial insects. Hemp is Tennessee's newest hard-hitting crop. It's grown to make CBD oil, which people use to help with a number of medical issues. Tens of thousands of acres will be grown across the state. Lee Bagwell's farm accounts for six, but he does much more. We're a diversified operation growing uh, row crops, uh, cattle, uh, tobacco, dark fire tobacco, and uh, hemp. This is his first year, and while there's been some learning, it's also somewhat familiar. It really fit our production methods with what we were doing with the tobacco and stuff right, so it was, it was a good fit for us. Tobacco is rocky in the state. Last year, a major tobacco receiving center closed down. Bagwell was able to maintain his contract, but having a hemp crop makes the farm more stable. Our farm's always been diverse, and uh, the hemp definitely gives us some sense of uh, safety, but it's because of we're more diversified, and if we have a crop failure on one side, the hemp, you know, we have something to kind of make, help make up for it, and that's, uh, that's really what we try to do. He says he hopes to break even on hemp this year, but if it's profitable, there's a chance he could increase the size of the operation. In Robertson County, Kyle Horan, News Channel 5. An estimated 38,000 acres of hemp will be grown in Tennessee this year. That is up nine times from last year.